Just, just do that. Thank you for being here, everybody. We have Tambourine Borelli with us, and Tambourine is running in Congressional District 10, which we just heard about uh, being created from some strange, bizarre stuff going on with the districts out there in Washington. And just for the record, Borelli with two R's. <laughs> exactly. Damn you great. got it. I saw it right there. Two R's. We're rolling. Yes. I, and we had to change that in like nine places. So that's that's me. All me. That's hilarious. Thank you for joining us, Tambourine. Uh, so, uh, thank you for having me. Yeah. You're, it's awesome. Uh, you're just one of the powerhouse women of Washington, Bernie Kratz. And uh, uh. <laughs> it's, it's really cool to, to have you on here. Tell everybody why you decided to run in Congressional District 10. Well, you know, uh, I'll generally answer the question, sure. not just in regard to District 10, but, you know, um, we have a crisis in this country. You know, our election system is broken, and that's being polite. <laughs> uh, you know, we have a criminal justice system that, you know, is nothing more than a despicable business. And I'm just going to go, if you don't mind, I'm just going to just give you the list in regard to really why I am Please. running this race. Um, Don't hold back. You know, we have a Congress that's compromised by legalized bribery from the outpouring of money through the lobbyists. Our government is controlled by corporations that are unregulated, um, unscrupulous <laughs> and unrelenting, you know, as they just persist on squeezing the poor of every last dollar that they've got when they think nothing of pouring money into the coffers of the war profiteers, you know, and they have the nerve to ask us how we'll pay for single payer. So I'm running because we have a system that seeks to devour every last resource of our beautiful planet. And for what? For the kleptocratic oligarchy that rules, that cares nothing except to fuel their power as if they didn't have enough to fuel their profit and their greed. You know, they poison our land, they poison our water, and they persecute those who seek to protect those things. So I'm really running to help change the face of politics. You know, so, so people like you and me and Tyler and, and all of us, you know, uh, can have People that we feel good about, finally, that are representing us because they're actually representing us instead of the special interests. Unlike the fork-tongued politicians who, on any given day, sell each and every one of us out on Capitol Hill, you know, and they give us smiles and platitudes <laughs> but they do nothing to change the condition of the suffering American people. So Absolutely. lastly, I'll just say that, you know, um, we've been lulled into an apathetic sleep, all of us, because we're so disheartened because nothing ever changes, you know, but I'm running because it's time for us to wake up. It's time for us to stand up and fight and protect and uh, rally for ourselves and rally and fight for this planet and rally and fight for our collective future because if we don't, we won't have one. Absolutely. So Absolutely. That's it in a nutshell. <laughs> I appreciate that. We don't have a lot of time or else I'd let you go on in a full elevate you know the, the, the full 15 I minutes get on speech. a tangent john no so. i know i know and and it's true it's really hard why are you running because our government is wholly corrupt and we got to fix yeah. it right i mean that's pretty which comes down to t we have this slide here right? it's hard for me to tell if this is the fool you're running against or a fool we just want to get out of office dennis heck who is this guy is he the guy it, it, so yeah um dennis heck um actually cd10 was created 
for him. Nice. Uh, in How 2012. nice. 2012. Yeah. Happy birthday. Um, it's a, it's it's the know, port. Is it the CD10 looks? Is it the port area right it there? It stops just short of the port. It's all of Thurston County, uh, quite a bit of Pierce County. It reaches up and grabs Shelton out of Mason County. Okay. Um, you know, so it's it's pretty vast. It's, and why? And they created it for him as this part of a gerrymandering fund. Uh, Total just, gerrymandering thing. Yeah. Okay. Okay. And is he a Republican or just vote that way? Well, well, funny, <laughs> funny that you ask, uh, John. <laughs> Because, you know, I always say it's hard to tell, yes. you know, people that are, are really concerned about flipping things to keep it blue or change, change it to blue. What difference does it make when you have someone who has a D behind their name, but they vote a lot of the times with Republicans and they kind of share the same corporatist interests. So that's yeah. pretty much Dennis Heck in a nutshell. It's, uh, yeah, that's what we're seeing with uh, we're trying to explain to everybody that it's not R&D anymore. It's corporate and progressive and yeah. and that's that's really the two you know and then within the corporate you have some republicans and democrats and i'm not even sure i want to get into those distinctions um but uh, uh tell everybody where you're going to be next uh you're out there you're campaigning you you, you, you know everybody in the, in the progressive movement is out there knocking on doors doing things where are you going yeah so uh there's a, a couple things that we're focusing on we just began our sign waving billboard um, events. Uh, we started in Lacey just yesterday and uh, we're going to be at Parkland Spanaway for a town hall. And that's on the 9th uh, between 10.30 and 12.30 and Shelton Town Hall at the Timberland Library uh, 4.14 from 1 to 2.30. So we're gonna have in conjunction with these town halls just a flood of the sign wave billboarding all awesome. over CD10 at, at every busy intersection. That's awesome. That's fantastic. That's a lot of people yeah. power that you're going to need there. Where can people go? Uh, and, and is there any specific kind of volunteer that you need uh, in terms of, of help? Yes. Uh, specifically, we need people to become part of our sign waving teams uh, nice. wherever that their town is. So if you could just go to Tambourine, that's T A M. B O R I N E 2018.com, and you can click the volunteer uh, button there, and uh, you can also click the donate button if you have a spare five. Absolutely. <laughs> we must fund our own, everybody. Tambourine's not going to get elected just with people power. We know that she needs money for signs and bumper stickers and everything that people are. That's, it's, it's the raw materials, gas to drive around. Um, so if you can spare a couple bucks here or there, seven bucks, 17 bucks, whatever you want, <laughs> let's help out Tambourine. And you can do this for all of our candidates at nmf.uphillmedia.org, or you can go to Tambourine 2018 to do it as well. Tambourine, thank you so much for being on. Um, I, I really appreciate you running. Uh, it's the hardest thing to do. And uh, I appreciate you being a part of the progressive movement. Thank you so much. John, thank you and for what you do for the progressive movement. We all appreciate you. Aw, thanks. We all do this together. Even the Germans got the Germans <laughs> helping us. Yeah. Do that or not. And, and uh, I'm glad that we are having you tomorrow on our We the People also. Oh, yes. For the long interview, which, which I'm looking forward to, you know. Yeah. Our, audience, our audience, I think, also. There it is. Oh, wonderful. There it is. Yes, you'll hear a lot more from Tambourine tomorrow, and I will let you just go off for at least 12 minutes. But 12 <laughs> minutes is your max. All right. Okay, awesome. All right. Thank, Thank you. John. Thank Bye. you, Tambourine. Bye-bye.